Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. It's another month. Bass Baits Monthly. This is the September box for 2021. If you don't know about Bass Baits Monthly, it's a monthly subscription box about $34, $35. And what they do is they send you a package every month, a box, and you get some really good products in it. I will say, other than Florida Tackle Club, this is the box to get in subscription tackle boxes. Uh, I think there's other ones that are very good, but consistently over the last seven, eight, nine months since February, this, I've only had one bad month. And I'm, I'm always surprised at what's in here and just how good, how good the name brand products are and just how good it is overall. So this is what we're gonna do. This is how we do it every month. We look at the overall quality of the products inside of this box. Now we judge it on a one to 10. It's, it's about quality of products. That's what we want. And then we're gonna do a rating on the fishability. Now the fishability is gonna be different where you live compared to what I live. Uh, so this is, it's all based on my opinion. So I wanna hear what you think, so comment below. Make sure you give this a thumbs up to start off with. Comment below and tell me what you think. I have not looked at the box at all. All I've done is cut it open. So you and I are gonna see it at the same time. So here we go. Like normal, they always start us off with how to do a certain knot. Try lean knot is always good to see. Sorry about the glare. There's a giant light right there. And then there's a light right there. So not like you need that. Oh, well, they're starting us off with a new Castaic square bill crankbait. Now this is a newer product from Castaic. This is actually one I just finished doing a closer look on. So I've only had the, the product for a little bit. It dives 2.5 feet, I think, or two to three feet. It's got that little square. It's, it's actually perfect for down here in Florida. Great wobble action and that, that's a, it's a good bait to start off with. Next, they starters, they have us with a Booya Counter Strike 3 8 Buzz Bait. Now that has two blades on it, so um, this can be used. Maybe not what I would like to see, but this is actually something fairly decent. Uh, looks like the, if you look at it, looks like the eyes are downward. I don't know if you can see that. I'll put it in the booth over there afterwards. Next, oh, they sent us uh, one more cast sticker, and you know where that goes. Garbage. Next, they sent a Spro Russ Lane Fat Papa 55 that looks like it dives five to nine feet deep. Maybe a little bit too deep for us, but that's right in the range. It's three eighths of an ounce, 55 millimeters. Good looking color. It's got a big bill on it though. Next, from Netbait, they sent some five inch big spanky little swim baits. Like that whole pack of it, it's called Smoking Shad. I definitely know that you can catch fish with those. Next, from Z-Man, the Schroditz Micro Finesse Jig, you get two of those in there. Looks like maybe some Ned head. It looks like some Neds, kind of. You never know. It's a two pack. These are three sixteenths of an ounce. You know, it's Z Man. Always good product. Good name product. From Missile Bait. Yeah, they did. These Missile Baits, they're sending some Ned Bombs. Those kind of pair up with the whatever these are called. Shruits. Whatever. So these together will be pretty good. And that's, oh wow, this is really nice from Kitech or Keytech, the custom worms. These are, this is a good product. These guys make a good product. I like to see that. That's the easy shiner. Uh, that's a, almost kind of a, a Japanese, is a Japanese bait. These are probably pricey. That's a great thing to get. I'm really happy about that, to be honest. So we got, uh, we got some Ned heads. We got those Kitex, the swim baits, the two hard, the hurt two hard baits, and then the 
the whatever. This thing. Which I've lost my brain and can't figure out. In terms of quality name products, I know everything in here. Netbait, uh, Missile, Kitek, Z-Man, Booya, Spro, Castaic. On a 1 to 10, I probably would give this probably a 9.5, 9.25, right in that range. I think the Kitek really people might not know about. And I don't know if, while I probably will use these net baits, I'm just not a big fan of, I don't know why. I don't know what, it's just me, it's just me. But in terms of quality products, probably, I'm going to say in 9.25 to 9.5. Now, fishability for me, uh, the Neds I probably won't use, which means the the little finesse jigs on, is out too. Uh, so in that Spro 5.9 is a little bit too deep. So of these, of the seven eight products that I got in here, three of them I'm not gonna be able to fish, or I won't fish. So probably I would give that because I'm not. I wouldn't say if I knew how to Ned fish, I probably would do it more. I just am not good at it. So they get a knock on it, but I mean, everybody else knows how to net fish. I'm just not that good. I'm just not as good as you, obviously. But uh, I probably would give this maybe an eight, eight and a half. I still think it's a good box. Those two products, I'm not gonna ding them too much for. The Deeper Diver five to nine, while it's just at the range of what is out of the limits for me, it's still in that range, but still, it's still another great box. In terms of value, I'll have to look that up and I'll pop it up right here of what the overall value is and uh, see what my value is versus what it cost. Well, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, try to make it quick and fast. Make sure you comment below and tell me what you think, how, what your rating is, I wanna hear. Also make sure you hit that subscribe button, like, comment, click that notification bell. And do a few things. Take a kid fishing, get your fish on, God, it seems like it's been a long time since I said that. Hope you have a blessed day. Cheers. Hit like and subscribe. Take your um kids fishing. <laughs>